Hello and welcome back to the Coding Hub. In today's video we will uh, show you how to get Ambraco set up locally onto your computer. For this exercise you will need Visual Studio. Um, you can get the free version which is Visual Studio Community Edition uh, which you can find on the Visual Studio website. Just Google Visual Studio Community and you will get a install link there. You can, uh, you will also need uh, SQL Server. Um, so you will have to do two things there. You'll have to install SQL Server Management Studios, which just Google for that. You'll get a download link again from Microsoft. And then f to get the SQL Server um, installation, you need to install SQL Server Developer Edition for the purposes of this tutorial. All of this you can find online, just Google for it and you will uh, just have to download it and install it onto your computer. So let's get started. Once you've installed everything you need onto your computer, um, you need to open up Visual Studio uh, Community Edition and create a new project. So let's go here and create a new project. And once you've selected create a new project, you need to choose a template. So for this, we will need a .NET um, project. And it is a .NET framework project. Uh, so let's see what we've got. So we have a SP.NET application with the .NET framework. This is the one you need. Um, so select that and click next. Here you will just need to uh, name your project something, um, just leave it as default or you can call it Morocco Training. Click Create. And then here you can choose uh, what type of project you want, whether it's a MT, a web form, uh, for the purposes of this tutorial um, we are going to select empty however you can select um, MVC um, which will also work. Uh, click create wait for it to finish. Whilst we're waiting for that to finish we need to create our database so if you head over to SQL management studios and open up your local host server you then can create a new database and if we wait for that to load and then let's call it Embraco Training again and then just click OK awesome Let's go back to Visual Studio, it's just finished. Okay. Now in here we will go to manage NuGet packages. And then in here we're going to click browse. And select the browse and then type in Umbraco. And you need to install Embraco CMS. Just click install. That will then collect all the packages that we need to install in order for this to work. Um, so let's just wait for it to load. Accept. And then I'll start installing Embraco and all its dependencies into your project. Let's just wait for that to finish. So, uh, writing over here. At this point, uh, you can um, you can grab the SSL version of the URL in here. Just run a project.
Nem volt egy plugin. Paste in the HTTPS version of the website. Just paste in the URL in there. And wait for it to load. Okay, and then the installation process of Umbraco begins. And then type in a secure password. And here, make sure you click customize. Uh, for this, click continue. And then now we have to add our database. So here, select Microsoft SQL Server. And for the server details, type in localhost and the database name, we're going to put Morocco tutorial. And then just click here, use integrated authentication, click continue. Validating the database connection. And make sure you actually call the database the right thing. So instead of Morocco tutorial, Morocco training. And let's try that again. Okay. And here we have the option of installing a starter website or having a blank website. For the purpose of this tutorial, we're just going to install the starter website just to show you what it looks like. So just wait for it to download and install the different. Uh, packages it needs, get a few things ready and redirect us to the new CMS experience of Embraco version 8.12 as of recording uh, on this video in March 2021. So hopefully we will get redirected any second now. And here we go. And this is the Morocco back office loading. And if we open up another tab, 
けちょっと待ってください、ね And then, if we load in the local host, we can see the local starter website uh, has been uh, has been installed onto um, the project. So that's how you get Embraco installed locally onto your machine and set up with a SQL database. I hope this video has been of great help. I hope to see you in the next video. Please like and subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. Thank you very much.